Hi, my name is Ethan. Today I'm going to show you how to make a procedural text generator using recurrent neural networks in my C-sharp neural network library. What you'll need for this is uh, some source text. Here I've got two paragraphs from a short story called Deep Holes I found on the internet. So the first thing we're going to want to do is have our new C-sharp project or wherever you want to do this. I'm just going to make a small console application that runs all in the main method. So, I've already got the main method in the class set up. I'm going to import all the namespaces I'm going to use. Load our example text. Let's load this using read all text. I have it in the file source.txt. Neural networks work best when you encode text with one hot encoding. So, next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to encode the text in one hot encoding. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to create our neural network structure. So this is defined by the input layer, the hidden layers, and the output layer. So the input layer's number of neurons is equal to the number of uh, characters in the dictionary. So we need to create our array of hidden layers. The one hidden layer is uh, going to have the same number of neurons, the input layer, recurring, and tanh activation function. And then our output layer is going to have the same dot count and then we're going to use exponential activation function and now we're going to create our neural network class so now we're going to set up the training data now with our training data set up we can uh, begin training the network so what we want to do is we want to create a new neural network trainer class and we need to package our in our training data one more time we're going to set the max and roll length to 25 and we do want cross entropy loss now we need to set a few settings in our trainer like the desired loss I'm gonna set this to 0 0.01 <clears throat> then the next thing we're gonna set is the learning rate to 0.1 F we need to run trainer start in it now we're ready to begin training our network so what we want to do is, is we're going to create the while loop where we train our network. We're going to run an iteration of the trainer and then we're going to make it sample and output the loss every 20 seconds. Do a memory of the time. If 20 seconds have passed, output the loss. Number of iterations done and we're going to output some sample text from the network. We're going to need to create a neural network program to run the network. We need a character integer. We're going to seed this with a random character from the dictionary. Add the first character to the text. And then we need to reset the uh, neural network program memory. And now we're going to run the neural network for 200 iterations. Get the character function random choice, which chooses a random index from a bunch of probabilities. Put in the input data into the neural network. So we'll manually do one hot encoding here by setting the one. And then we'll remove it and reset it after it's been run reset the last time with the now time and there we go now at first the neural network will output complete gibberish like this but as it goes on you'll begin to notice familiar patterns that are in English or whatever language you put into the network 